Well, Ron, Raymond Rowe is being held in prison without bail. He is set to appear in court next week to face the charges against him. Now, these court documents shed more light on what police say happened inside school teacher Christy Marak's apartment in Lancaster the morning of her death, December 21st, 1992. The documents here reveal that police found scuff marks on her front door and in the hallway, indicating a struggle as she was about to leave. The papers show that two neighbors walking nearby told police they heard a high-pitched, unexpected scream from the victim's apartment between 710 and 720. The autopsy showed Marak suffered a broken jaw, had a tooth knocked out, and bruises. She'd been sexually assaulted, the cause of death strangulation. The DA's office hired a Virginia company that uses genetic genealogy to solve cold cases back in 2016. Investigators say a match was found. Now, according to these papers, they began to have surveillance of Raymond Rose's home here in Lancaster on May 15th. It was a short time later they connected D collected DNA from him, gum, and a water bottle. And then he was arrested more than 25 years after the investigation began. Live in Lancaster, Barbara Barr, WGAL News 8.